What's up, guys? <laughs> <laughs> it's a vlog day. Yay! <laughs> and uh, we're going to Endless Summer. We got Endless Summer for one night. Yeah, at Universal um, Orlando Resort. So we're really excited because we don't really usually go to Universal at all. We are at Universal Annual Pass holders, but we are trying to take advantage of the fact that we are. So yes, we booked a night at Endless Summer. I've been dying to stay here. Yeah. It's exciting. <laughs> <laughs> so let's go. Uh, sorry, what were you going to say? Go. No, go for it. So let's just go have some fun. Let's go check in. We're probably just going to hang out at the resort today. Maybe we'll pass by the park tonight because we do have Express Pass after four. That's true. Since we are annual pass holders, so we could definitely take advantage of that. Let's do this. Let's go have some fun. They have surf side and dock side. We're staying on the dock side section. We just checked in. We got early park admission tomorrow. You, we actually have to go in with these. Uh, I guess you show these to the front of the park. Yep. You show these at the front of the park and you don't like, these are basically our tickets to get in tomorrow. We just got to the parking lot. We are so excited. Got the amazing wagon to bring in our essentials. We're staying in tower one and it's looking gorgeous. I'm so excited made it inside oh, we're so ready for this little one night vacation staycation are you excited okay i'll take that as a yes <laughs> <laughs> so we just got off of the elevators and wow they have this really really beautiful wallpaper here with the beach they also have these really really nice ceilings up here what are these things like what are these things called like wooden panels, wooden panels. That, there you go show them the so view. beautiful Oh yeah, you want to show them the view? Check it out, dude. So I'm pretty sure that's Cabana Bay right over there. Let me zoom in on it. Pretty sure that's Cabana Bay right there. Is it? Yeah, right there. That's Cabana Bay. Oh yeah, that's Cabana Bay. And then we got Hogsmeade right there. We got um, Dr. Doom's Fearfall. Rip Ride Rocket. Rip Ride Rocket. You can see everything. The Hulk. You can even see a piece of Velocicoaster right there as well. Oh, you can? Such a nice view though. This is not our room view, this is the elevator view, but we'll show you guys the room view in a sec. By the way, check out my Spider-Man card. Oh my gosh. So this isn't the two bedroom suite. This is actually just one room, but, but to turn on your light here, you have to make sure you put your key in, then they give you electricity. So right when you walk in, you have this beautiful bathroom right here so we got a room that the bathroom is actually facing the right right when you walk in so this is just very very simple sink but i love 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 what they did here it's so nice i love these lights so nice then you also got your bathtub very sweet Oh, look, they give you shampoo, conditioner, and they also give you a little cleansing bath bar. Very great. This is comes in handy when you forget to bring your own shampoo and conditioner, which happens to me quite often. So walking out of the bathroom, you have kind of like this little closet here. Like a little storage area, basically. So you can hang any of your clothes. You also got an ironing board iron and you're safe as well extra pillows up here and when you come this way you have the actual room so beautiful so you have um, your two beds here so they actually didn't give us a king bed they just gave us um, two queen beds which is fine that's fine but this is perfect if you're coming with like somebody else as well these very nice lights up here like little night lights on top of you instead of next to you which i find that pretty unique 
bed look pretty comfy. This is nice backboard. Just very, very beautiful. Love that. Also got these beautiful pictures up here, like right above the bed. Very beachy. This is one of the reasons why this resort caught my attention so much, because it's very, very beachy vibes, very summery, endless summer, obviously. <laughs> And um, we got like literally the greatest view. Can I show them the views? Oh, us? yeah, we'll show you All guys. Right, the so, view. the same view that we got from the elevator, we actually got it in our room. So, we could see Islands of Adventure literally from, right from our hotel, which is insane. Look at that. That's incredible. And then, right in front of the bed, you also have this really nice TV. It's like a good size, it's not huge, but I feel like it's perfect for the space. This is kind of like a really like long desk. You got Bible in here. Mini fridge. You open it. Very nice, perfect. And then some cups here. I'm a little disappointed we don't have coffee in the room. Yeah, that was a little bit of a letdown. Like just a little bit disappointed, but that's fine. We have nice Starbucks downstairs, so I can't yeah. complain. Okay. And then right next to the TV, you have this really nice like little chair. I really like that with the little lamp on top. Very modern, right? Yeah, I like it. I like it. Very beachy as well. By the way, we completely forgot to show you guys the room does come with its own little bottle of hand sanitizer, which is pretty nice. It even has the logo of the hotel on it. Uh, Jessica wanted to show you guys this little chest, but she forgot to show you. It's not a, like you can't actually open it. Like it doesn't open. I, I don't know. It's cute and stuff, but. You can't really use it, but. You can yeah. just put things on top of it, you know? Yeah. That's it. It's cute though, I like it. The room, the room in general is actually really nice. Yeah. So we made it to Dockside's Pier 8 Market. This is where we're gonna grab some food. So they got so much food here, guys. Just so much selection. So Jessica got the Beyond Burger and I got the barbecue cheeseburger. So let's see how it is. Ooh, they cut gelato. Dude, let's get some gelato. Oh, absolutely. We're gonna get some gelato. Chocolate gelato. Oh, I, I think I, I think that one's calling my attention. That uh, salted caramel gelato Ooh. right there. All right, let's do it. Ooh. So we got our food. Oh my gosh, open your, your burger there. Barbecue Look. burger. Ooh, with bacon, some fries and onion rings. And then I got the um, plant-based burger with some fries. Ooh, I'm excited. Let's dig in. All right, so we just finished our food. My burger was delicious. Did you like your burger? Oh, I thought it was amazing. It was really, really good. I'm really full now. I'm really full, but everything was delicious. I mean, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah, yeah, the fries were like seasoned perfectly. How did you like the onion rings? It was pretty good, yeah. Everything yeah. was delicious. He threw in some extra fries, which was really nice of him. Oh, that's sweet. Um, but it was really good. Um, we're gonna chill here now. We had some of our gelato. Oh, the yeah. salted caramel ones. We got salted caramel and chocolate. I would get this one. This one was a lot better. The chocolate one, it was all right. It was it was a little bit like too plain for me. Yeah. But this salted caramel was delicious, especially when you mix it with the actual like Ooh. salted caramel at the bottom. Oof, so good. So yeah, we're just gonna hang out here in the room for a little bit longer. We're gonna get ready and probably go to the park tonight, maybe Universal or Islands. We don't know yet. I just want to hang out there and have a good night. And have fun. So let's just uh. Let's just continue this journey. All right, so we made it down to the lobby and we just called an Uber because we were gonna take a bus to go to Universal, but it's very, very packed and very crowded here. So we didn't really feel like waiting that bus line, so we just called an Uber. Um, but check this out, guys. Look at this. There's so many cars just like waiting all the way back there just to check in. Well, guys, we made it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is already back at full capacity. I'm not sure if Disney is yet. Disney has been pretty packed lately, but this looks this looks crazy. All right, so we chose to go to Islands of Adventure first, but it looks like it's gonna rain. It smells really good over here. It smells like sugar. It does smell like sugar. Look how beautiful that is up there. So we just noticed that the Hulk and Dr. Doom's Fear Fall both are not operating at the moment due to lightning. We actually, um, as we showed you guys before, we have the view of the park from our hotel room. So we actually saw both rides operating earlier today, but looks like they stopped operating just a, a few minutes ago. First ride of the night, Spider-Man. 
and we're going to Express. bite I've actually eaten in here before there's like pizzas salads it's actually pretty good look how cool what they do up there like some projections on the roof so we just found a table outside with a nice view of the Hulk Louis got a what is it that you got meatball sub meatball sub I got a little salad with some fruit and we got a Coke, Powerade, and water to hydrate ourselves. Let's do it. We're going on School Island Ring of Kong. I don't think Jessica's ever been on this. I have never been on this. I was this. actually here opening day. Cool. Let's do it. On River Adventure, Kong was actually really good. What did you think about Kong, man? Um, I mean, I had never gone on it before, so the animatronic was amazing. Yeah, that Kong animatronic, dude, it took my breath away. I don't even remember yeah. that that animatronic. I completely forgot that even existed. But, but Lewis, it was. Louis was telling me that the ride before was much better. Well, the old Kong. Okay. All right, we're gonna have to put our ponchos on because we're going on River Adventure. So give us a sec. Thank you. Turn around and say bye. <laughs> 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 
Here you guys Thanks, go. Man. Have a good one. You too. Whoa. Looks beautiful, honestly. They, they killed it with the forced perspective on this one. Oh yeah, they did. All right, guys, we got our lockers. We are locker five and locker 15. I will not forget that, 515. Let's go ride this Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey. <laughs> I am so ready. I haven't ridden this in years. Oh my gosh. I'm aware of that. May we survive by the sea of these pants is more than likely. Now, uh, your wrong, Salazar. It was love that saved young Harry, not luck. <laughs> long-standing, long-deceased history of magic professor will, for your enjoyment, condense hundreds of years of Hogwarts history into a few short hours. Enjoy your stay with us. My eyes never stopped looking about Potter's Quidditch skills. I'd really rather see for myself. <laughs> Observatory! Was kind of all over the place with the footage we went on forbidden journey twice yes we did and then right when we got out of our like out of the ride our second time the the hogwarts show started going on it I'm was so sure, awesome what's that show called uh, put it in the comments we don't know what that show's called but put it in the comments if you guys do know what show that is yeah you guys or saw I can it put it down below right now <laughs> that's the name all right cool cool yeah we'll do that <laughs> but it was awesome i've never seen that before so it was a cool experience yeah these last 30 minutes were uh, pretty amazing they were probably one of the best moments i've had here at island yeah i, I haven't i haven't really got, gotten to experience islands like this so like i'm having a blast i'm yeah, having really a good time i would recommend coming at nighttime if you don't want to be out in the scorching sun and if you want to get on stuff really fast we got we got to get on Forbidden Journey two times in a row. So yeah. we, we we walked right on. We do have express passes, but True. it was like it was a short line anyways. It the was line, like twenty five minutes. It was empty for no, like a regular. The regular line was empty, so yeah. it would have been a walk on. So we walked onto it a first time. Asked the guy, hey, can we go on again? And he got us on one more time. And uh, oh man, that was just so fun. See you tomorrow. All right, so we decided to do Hollywood Drive in Gulf. Because, you know, we thought emptying the night and just going to the resort wasn't an option for us. We wanted to stay and do something a little fun before we head back to the resort. So, first time doing this, let's give it a go. Oh, guys, look at how sick this one is. We got the hole back here. All right, babe, go first. Yeah, go for it. You got to start over there. Yours is the, the, the shorter one. All right, so Jessica's going to go first. No, you gotta go back there. Right there. Right here. <laughs> that was a nice shot. Oh, yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> Watch out, you're gonna hit the ball. Alright, three.
I want to do the haunted section next time. There's there's two golf courses. There's the sci-fi one and then the haunted one. We did the sci-fi one. Yeah, the sci-fi one was really cool. I can't wait to do the, the haunted one. The haunted one's gonna be awesome. Sorry, next time we come, we'll definitely do it though. But yeah, for sure. Sorry if we didn't record a lot of it. There was like we were just kind of having a good time, but right. it was a good time. So who who won? Jessica definitely won that one. She killed me, man. <laughs> <laughs> good job though, babe. All right, everybody, so we just made it back to the room. Um, we were actually just kind of debating if we were gonna do the early the early admission tomorrow or if we're just gonna go back home and then maybe come back at four. Um, I was thinking we, we'd rather, like I'd rather do that because we do have express pass after four. Right. But um, we're just kind of like, we, I, I personally just wanna find out if we can get on Hagrid's tomorrow. After four, I hope we can. That's, that's the mission tomorrow, just to ride Hagrid's and get her on Velocicoaster. So that's what we gotta do. Yeah. So uh, just gonna let you guys know, we got this room for 130 on bookings.com. Um, I know this room actually runs at $88 a night and you could actually get the whole two bedroom suite for 88 bucks, depending on what time of the year or whenever it's busy or when it's not busy. Yeah, which whenever. is a really good price, especially if you're coming like with your family and all. Like, I think this yeah. is a great resort. It's, it's beautiful. I really enjoyed this room so far, so I can't wait to enjoy it a little bit more of what's left. Yeah, it's, <laughs> you know, it's just a nice little, it's a beach getaway kind of. It's kind of like a beachy getaway in Universal. It has a nice vibe to it. It's very, it very modern, very clean, very new. Mm -hmm. So uh, if you guys want a nice, I think it's actually the cheapest on property resort in Orlando. Right. So that's 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 pretty amazing and it's and it's nice. So if you guys are interested in coming to Orlando or coming to Universal and you don't want to spend that much money on a hotel, endless summer guys, endless summer. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> but um yeah, any, any anything else? Yeah, no, I mean that that's pretty much it. We'll keep you guys updated on what we do tomorrow, but so far we hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching and for being here and we will Catch you guys on the next one. Peace. Bye, guys.